Kamal Barlow from Drop Zone MMA, making his way into the fight light ring. Making his way into the red corner. And his opponent into the blue corner. Please welcome Gaz Holmes. <laughs> Gaz Holmes making his way into the blue corner, representing 360 MMA from Lufra. Introducing first, the fighter from the red corner, weighing 62.7 kilograms, fighting out of drop zone MMA, Kyle Barlow. And his opponent, the fighter from the blue corner, Weighing 62.9 kilograms, fighting out of 360 MMA, Gat Ho! Featherweight bout, both men weighed in well under the limit though. Both experienced for the Fight Light promotion as well, Kyle Barlow, his second show for Fight Light, and Gaz Holmes, his fourth. Start out strong. Man being busy with the hands. Barlow's a southpaw. And he's to work that outside kick. Gets teeth caught and he gets tripped. Early takedown there from Barlow. Barlow can use that southpaw stance to his advantage. See if he can use that, uh, that left hand a lot. Both men leading with hooks and leading with kicks so far. Nice straight right there from Gaz. Both men moving very well, good spinning back kick there from Holmes. Both men light on their toes. Superman attempt. Gaz Holmes starting out very flashy. Goes to the judo, gets it right away. Turns a hip and throws him right over. Real nice there from Holmes. Heavy more, uh, movement forward from Barlow. Ends up in the clinch. Turned by Holmes. And again by Barla. Nice punch on the break there from Gaz. Really uh, underused tool in uh, any MMA kind of sport. He's punching on the break and he's, he used it really well there. Both men up on the ropes again, jumping the position. Both men slow down a little bit, a little less on their toes now. Barla's looking forward heavily. Oh, and a lovely lead there from Holmes. Just double leg there from Barlow. Can he finish? He's got a little lift. Oh, yeah. What a game. There it is. Finishes the takedown. Ends up on top to end the round. Really, really fast paced round. You can see on the face of both guys. Really interesting round from both guys, both men very, very light on their toes, really good movement from both, clinching up regularly, it's like Barlow's got a nice double leg on him and Holmes is liking that judo throw. Nice inside low kick, start off by guys, a little warning there, might have come out a little stiff. Throwing into the pocket and throws him pretty wild exchanges to start off with. Gaza switched to southpaw. Comes down with some nice day up He's going for that judo again, turn the hip. Barlow's managed to reach around, go for the double leg. The break. Just getting there from Barlow. Barlow again, but down with Gaz Holmes back on the ropes. Go for the judo again. Nice loser, that Gaz using his head very well. Like I said, both men experienced in the far line promotion. Gaz Holmes 
one win, one draw. Been on both TC events. Carl Barlow was on TC too. Barlow looking for the judo there. The head just slipped out. Gaz Hand ends up on his back. It's quite an exhausting pace. Both men moving a lot in the kickboxing and working very hard in the clinch as well. Barlow comes forward again. The clinch again. And Gaz Holmes gets a trip this time. Both fairly even on the takedowns. And both men have taken each other down a few times. Myers, I think Gaz is landing more punches, but Barlow's being the aggressor. He's putting Gaz is back on the ropes every time. He looks deep in there. He's drop down on the hips and suck him out. Gaz is aware of it. He drops his hips back, but Barlow's still one just to get it. Both men look like they're tiring a little bit now. Nice strokes coming for Barlow. He's landing a little more now. Again being the aggressor. Again pushing Gaz back onto the ropes. Clinching up. It's the end of the second. Both men are rather tiring now. Should be an interesting third round. I think it's uh, anybody's fight going into the third. I think if Gaz could uh, try and time Barlow's forward movement, just level change from under him, he can score on that double leg a few more times. Barlow has a very heavy forward movement. He's really stomping forward with those straights. If Gaz can use it against him. to the third. See if we can see a more uh, clear winner in the, in, the, in the striking exchanges. To me, Barlow's being the aggressor. He's throwing his hands fairly wild, but his aggressive style's working. Guys is trying to fight back now. Guys take the centre of the ring. Let's put the straight left, though. Guys really needs to get his hands up. He needs to be covering his little cleaner. They're coming straight down the middle. Then that straight left is working for uh, for Barlow. Flips him with a right hook. Looks like Gaz is a little stunned by that one. I think, I think it might have been a bit of a groin shot there. Off a break, but they come back clean. Gaz being a little more aggressive now. Coming forward a little heavier. Barlow meets him in the centre. Both men are trading. Again, the left hand just looks like it's coming through for Barlow. Gaz has got the head to see if he looks more like judo. He's there in the clinch. Gives up his back, tries to turn back in, and Barlow takes him down. Barlow gets to take down and up on top. Nice Superman punch out from Gaz lands, but Barlow, there's just no stopping him. He's coming forward, there's no stopping him in his tracks. Gaz seems to have uh, bailed on the judo. I've not seen him really turn that hip in since the first round. He's now going for the double leg. Right under hook from Barlow, he needs to pick that up high. He's got doubles. Look at the judo now, and he gets it. Goes back to his bread and butter from the first round. And Barlow doesn't look phased by it. Still takes the center of the ring. Comes forward again. Gaz, I think that was a trip there. Barlow ends up on top. Definitely didn't look good for the judges. The clinch up again. Again, another judo throw there from Gaz. He's landed two in the end, in the end minutes there. Really compared to that for both men. Really impressive display by both. Good exchanges in the grappling and in the striking. 